Now we're doing another one. Okay, so this is the second one. And just while the other one is dry. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so I'm gonna use this. I painted already, so it's dry. The paint underneath it's dry. The same color? No. Let's choose another color. How about a gold one? Gold. I like. Mm. Yeah, it'll look nice, yeah, because of contraction. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. That deep brown. Now, what you can't do is to put it too wet. So, you take the excess. This is a gold, it's called metallic glaze finish mm. from Decor. It's pretty. Can you paint tiles with that ceramics? Yes, if it's a shiny one, it needs to be sanded down mm -hmm. before. So the paint sticks to it. Beautiful. And I love the shine. It's so cool. goes so well with the green. But now this usually I don't like to leave the color like too green, too plain. Mm -hmm. I like to sand down. It has few steps to make it look finished. If you see the other picture, the other pieces around, they all have a finish. So what I do, I send it down, especially when it has something, design. some blanish design, mm -hmm. it shows more than it, when it's just painted. So I like to see that the original thing was wood underneath. Mm -hmm. It gives mm -hmm. some distress and yes. look. Hello. This is a very light sand. Mm -hmm. so. Get another one. Get a soft one. Hello there. Hi. Sit down, we're almost done. You can see the blue art pattern. I like to see the distress from the corners. Mm -hmm. Secrets of the tree. Of the master. <laughs> tricks. <laughs> tricks of the tree. They got tricks. <laughs> I knew I was missing something. That's cool. Yeah, you see all the seeds. like a worn piece that it was around for a long time that was left by your great grandmother. Yeah, it gives you character. Mm -hmm. Some memories out there, right? But I wow. keep like with the today's style. You like oh, I do. I like, looks mm -hmm. beautiful. No, it's no, yes. Yeah, this is worn out. Look aging. Right? Now, it's gonna look even nicer. Now you see you take the excess because mm -hmm. uh, actually the best thing to use is, where is it? It's a, um, how do you call this? A cloth. Yeah, but, um, uh, that brand. <laughs> Wipe Swiffer. Oh, wow. Swiffer. Oh, okay. I yeah. See. Yeah. yeah. So it takes mm. really good. Sticks to it. Right. Oh, now yes. it looks I gotcha. To give that yummy 
like a, a moisturizing on your skin when the skin is really dry. Mm -hmm. And it helps to protect the paint. I use wax or could be a water-based varnish. This is B-Wax. Now look. Look. Mm. Yummy. Huh? Mm -hmm. Very nice. Isn't that great? Yes. So it brings the color. It's like having a glass of water in a hot sunny day. Mm. It does. Citric, right? Something mm -hmm. like around yeah, there. Orange oh, oil. Lovely. Yeah. Lovely. Very yeah. nice. Yeah, orange citric from. And then after you apply, you know, a few minutes later, you just buff it. With another fabric? Yes, with a, uh, a lint free mm -hmm. fabric. That's what the part will do. Or you, you, what do you use? What kind of fabric? This one is just cotton, but they, mm -hmm. they say lint free. This is not lint free, but mm -hmm. still does the work. Look where you have the blemish, it looks even super nice. Yeah. Great finish. Right? Special box. Very special box. And then to finish, this one is made in Nicaragua. But not in with my Ludo Castle designs. <laughs> okay, now it's also Ludo Castle design. And here we go. I hope you enjoy. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you, Arthur.